Hello friends, it's Shara and welcome. I appreciate you guys being here. I have gorgeous Carol Lee here. Um, excuse the band-aids, I wasn't picking. I broke two nails and they went down all the way and they hurt so bad, so I have band-aids on. Um, I have beautiful Carol Lee here. I wanted you to see uh, her in her entirety and, uh, and the outfit that I'm gonna dress her in. I did her hair. I was so proud of myself. I was able to get um, her hair in these two adorable pigtails. I'm not sure if you call them pigtails. I'm not sure what they'd be called, but they are so cute. And I'm so proud of myself that I was able to do them all by myself. <laughs> so I am going to be um, getting her changed into that beautiful, checkered um, blue and white dress with the yellow um, and white daisies and then I'll be putting her in those blue striped shoes so I won't have to do her hair I decided not to do that on camera because I didn't know how well that was going to go <laughs> but it went well it didn't take me long I just lay her on the bed and put her head hanging over the edge that's what I do with sweet Maddie and it works perfect and I was able to get her hair done and I just love it it's so cute our little girl is so pretty so let's get her changed I'm gonna re-angle the camera down to the changing table and lay her flat to get her changed and then we'll just have a little chat all right we're back and while I had her I um, up I uh, undid the snaps so happy Saturday to everyone I hope you're enjoying your weekend we are enjoying ours being a little lazy I do have to throw in some laundry but that's easy. I only have one load. I try not to uh, let it get past that. <laughs> my son does my bedding for me because it is more difficult for me to do. And he did that for me today. So that was lovely. So how is everyone doing? I hope everyone is well. I um, am really um, enjoying the babies. I don't have any um, coming and uh, that's a first for me. I do have my um, custom that's being done by my friend, but that one, um, you know, there's no time frame for that. And uh, that one's been in the works for quite a while. I don't need to change her diaper. She's recently had a diaper change. And I am going to try to put this. Now, this is a Gymboree. So it is a 12 to 18 month. But I think it's meant to be a blouse. And I tried it on Maddie because that's who I intended to put it on because it was such a big size. Um, and it didn't fit her, it was too small. So I'm hoping that it fits little Miss Carolee. I don't mind if the sleeves are a little big, but it should fit her just right in the length. And that is what I'm hoping. And I don't mind if her white t-shirt shows through at her arms, that'll be fine. Um, it doesn't feel like it's gonna be too big. Um, that's pretty funny because it's a 12 to 18 month size and, um, I still have to snap it up in the back. So button it up in the back. So it is fitting perfect. <laughs> I'm so excited. Are you going to get your hand in here, Missy? Huh? And I think that the blue and white striped shoes will be okay. Um, I kind of like mixing up patterns like that. I think it's cute. And um, they're the right color, so I think it'll look okay. You guys will have to tell me if you think it looks bad. Oh, look at that. That is not too big at all. Well, that makes me really excited because I might be able 
to purchase some clothes from Jimboree because you can't purchase baby clothes from them anymore. Oh my goodness, that fits her so beautifully. There's no way this would fit um, even as a blouse because it's too narrow. There's no way it would fit an older baby. How sweet is that? Oh my goodness, little Carolee, you look so cute. Let's sit her up and button the back. It fits beautifully. <laughs> way better than I uh, expected. I planned for it to be big and I wasn't going to mind, but um, <laughs> it is not big. It is perfect. All right, let's get this button. You know me and buttons and then having a band-aid. You should see the text I'm sending because I have a band-aid on my thumb trying to send texts. Ah, they're terrible. I have to apologize to everyone that I'm DMing on Instagram because my texts look horrible. And of course, you know, sometimes I hit send and I don't realize that it's been bad. And I look like, um, like I don't know what I'm saying <laughs> or I don't know how to spell. While we have her up, I am going to brush her hair to make sure. Oh my gosh. And look, it's not even big at her arms. Not really. Not for a 12 to 18 months. She's a zero to three, maybe just maybe a, a three to six on some things, but uh, she's certainly not a 12 to 18 month size. And Maddie isn't even that size. I'm not gonna do much. I love the way her piggy tails came out. So just give it a little brush. <laughs> I had so much fun doing this. I couldn't remember the style and I thought, well, I'm just gonna go for it. And oh my goodness, how adorable does she look? So precious, oh my goodness. That matches your eyes so well. And I don't think the color of the ponytail holders is bad. It's not perfect, but it's not bad. Let's see if we can push you up just a little bit so that, um, they can see your feet while I put on your, um, oh, I think that, I don't know where this came from. Was that on her head? Oh my gosh, I think that might have been lost in something. And I um, didn't put that on someone. I had a different plaid one. Maybe that was caught up in the dress and I didn't even know it. You know, I sent a baby home. I sent a baby home. Um, I sold a baby and uh, I sent her home and I'm very careful to make sure there's no dog hair or my hair. You know, I, I think that, you know, is just proper, but you know, it happens. But I, you know, really try to be conscious of that. <laughs> and the the woman sends me a text saying, you know, she got the baby. She loves the baby. And she goes, but you may be missing a sock. And she sends me a picture of a, stock, a sock that was stuck to the baby's back. And I had been looking for like an hour. I was even like, son, you have to go look under the bed. There's no way I could lose a sock. I don't know how I could possibly lose a sock that I don't even throw in the washer because that's where you usually lose socks. Oh, those look cute. They're a little big, but they look cute. Oh, I like those. I think those are sweet. Anyway, I had <laughs> I had sent the sock off with, with a doll I sold. So she's going to pop it in the mail for me. But isn't that the funniest story? I just cracked up. She sent me a photo of it. And I'm like, that's my missing sock. And it was a brand new sock and it's very tiny. So it's a, a sock that I didn't want to miss. <laughs> I didn't want to lose. So I asked her if she can just put it in a regular envelope. You know, it won't be more than a stamp to send it to me. And that was so funny. I was just cracking up. <laughs>
<laughs> so I found my missing sock, but it had been mailed with a baby. <laughs> Good thing it wasn't overseas because it would have been a little bit uh, ridiculous to send it back. So, well, Miss Carolee looked beautiful. This was a nice, fast changing. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute. I'm gonna get her sitting up so you guys can see. I don't even think I'll need to put um, a diaper cover because she does have the white onesie. I think I'll uh, sit her up and let you guys see her um, actually sitting. Hold on one minute. All right, friends. Well, Dave was just itching to come on because he said he matched his sister so well that he had to come on. He has blue and white stripes, so he matches her shoes. And then he's got the blue pants and the blue trim on the bib. And I think, look at his stripes. They just match perfectly. So he's like, mommy, mommy, I want to go with sissy. So... Here he is, and of course, all the babies love Dave. They just love their little big brother. He's their oldest brother, but he's one of the smallest that we have in the nursery. So here is Miss Carolee looking beautiful. I think I will pop some uh, little bloomers on her um, just because I think that uh, little girl should have you know, some covering and uh, she looks so beautiful. Let me get her looking right at her aunties and uncles. Oh, they all look so beautiful. And you see little Grace back here and you see our little Bumblebee. <laughs> and you see all the lovies we have here. The changing table's quite crowded, but uh, we can still use it, so that's okay. All right, friends. Well, thanks for coming and watching little Carolee get her beautiful dress on and show off her beautiful hairstyle that mommy was able to do. I'm so proud of myself. They turned out so cute. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, enjoy the rest of your weekend. We loved having you here. And as always, friends, we are all sending you wishes of love and light. And we will see you in the next video. Can you say bye and blow kisses, Dave? Mwah. Mwah. Bye, friends.